Gryffindor gang. Here she is. This crazy person that keeps popping up at our house. Look at her. Look at her. Look at this thing. No, gang, hold on. Before I begin this video, let me expose Diana. What's with all this bird shit on your. This looks like it's been like. What, how? Look at this. Look at this. Why are you? Uh, hey, hey, little buddy. Hello. <laughs> what the? <laughs> no, okay, this car is like. Oh my god. Let me show you something real quick. Let me show you. That diffuser, though. That diffuser, though. Oh my god. Yo, she's. Hey, she's killing the Kia game. You guys don't know already. Follow Diana at what is this? Oh, Diana dot Forte Life on Instagram. All right, whatever. I guess, <laughs> I guess we're just gonna begin the video. So what's going on, Norgang? So this is Ray from Nord.TM. I have a, a, a short one, but a goodie. And this is, I know every time I make these videos, look, I'm gonna tell you off rip. It's subjective as hell. Like, it's always gonna come down to, I don't know, like, some people like doing performance mods before visual mods, and some people like the other way around. Me, I like doing performance, I mean, well, I like performance mods, everything's gotta be functional, hence why, hold on. Hence why I haven't gone, on, gone so crazy with visual mods, cause I'm sure that my car, my Z could have probably looked nuts by now, but in the end, uh, it's, I just wanna go fast. I wanna go fast. There's one thing that I always want first, and I'll talk about that later in the video, because it all has to do with it, blah, 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 whatever, you guys get the point. The three must-have mods for your 370Z, and a lot of people are probably gonna disagree with me on this one, but it's, look, like I said, it's all subjective. If you guys have any, uh, if you guys don't like what I say, leave in the comments what you guys would do first, or the top three mods that you think you should have on your Z first. Let's begin. Dude, look at look at these wheels, dog. Damn. Oh my God. Hey, why are you stunting so hard on them, bro? Like, damn. Hey, hey, what size is these? Hey, what size are these wheels, bro? What are these? Twelves, thirteens, fours? Hey, you stunting too hard, girl. Okay. To be fair, I am gonna bundle some of these up because I, it all ties in together. So, it, I feel like you can't do one thing without the other. So, if you see, actually, two mods, whatever. If you get butt hurt, I guess I'll I'll call it like five or whatever. But. I'm still gonna call it three because because I can. I don't care. <laughs> Mod number one: wheels and suspension. Bro, I don't care who you get. What the hell? What is going on over here? Diana, no, I got you. I got you guys. Oh, look, 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 look. There she is. Oh, look, I got her. Oh, damn. We were that close. So to begin with, man, I don't know about what you guys think, man, but whenever I buy a car, oh, I'm gonna say it right next to you because you know since it's your sister. And I'm a squat. I don't know why, but I'm a squat. I, I always like lowering my cars and putting them on wheels first because before I get into something, I like it to look nice first. Like your sister. <laughs> I'm going to hell. I don't know. I don't care who what you guys say. I hate the sport wheels on Z's. I love the Nismo wheels, but they still sit too high in my opinion. I'm still kind of monster trucking, in my opinion. I can probably lower it a little bit more. You always gotta have a good stance. I, I don't know, maybe, I don't know, watch my stance, so you guys are like, bro, you don't even stance that well, I'm like, <laughs> fuck. Norgay, I just don't know what it is, like, every time I get a car, before I even put anything, bro, first thing I always look for, wheels and coilovers, that's always, that's like, a must have, I feel, on every car, because even though it might not be fast yet, or whatever the case may be, or maybe it's already fast, who knows, who cares, it's, I feel like, I love turning heads just with a, a simple, simple mods, which it could be kind of pricey, but you know, depending on what setup you get. But I mean, honestly, my wheels are, uh, they're reps of Verson uh, ES2s and I'm on stance coilover. I got very lucky with this setup, but people love seeing it. I mean, to be honest, people are always telling me they love the wheels, they love the stance and I think it's pretty simple, but I mean, it turns heads and that's what I, and I feel like that's such a major mod. If you're doing one simple thing and it's causing a lot of people to comment on how much they love it, you did good, you did good. Let me quickly get into the next one. Damn, damn, your boy has to actually like pop the hood for this one, bro. Ugh. All right. Ugh. All right, now gentlemen, now. What I'm about to bring up, I might not have the best ones, but again, I got these on a serious hook. What the? <laughs> I got these on a serious hookup, so no complaints, but you gotta get yourself some intakes, boys. Now, like I said, these aren't really the best ones. Uh, there are, I have some other ones that I'm not gonna ex expose yet. I mean, I'm sure most of you guys already know if you 
You're in the VQ game, you already know. You gotta get intakes, man. You gotta let this engine breathe better. Not only will you get a little bit better throttle response, maybe, I think a little bit of a horsepower gain, but once you put intakes on, the car just feels so much better. Like, and these aren't even that great, to be honest. They're still in Gen 2s. Uh, I know a lot of people run them. I. I think they're okay, uh, but I definitely do think it's time for an upgrade. It's still like once I got on, once you once you put them on, man, it's an immediate enjoyment. Like I'm not gonna take away from that at all. Intakes are a must-have. I recommend Z1 intakes for anyone. The actual cold air intakes that go in under the bumper. Just a little pro tip, dude. Look how look how hot, man. But your boy's glistening. That sounded a little like Edward. All right, last one, last one. What do you guys think it is, man? What do you guys think it is? I made fun of my car for months about this, bro. Months about this. And for all the OGs who've been on my channel for a little while, before, I, this was before I had 100 subs. Like, it's, it, I made so many jokes about this, but it's so fucking true. I, I don't care what anybody says, you can suck me. Well, I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna be that mean, but if you don't agree with me on this one, dude, you have to be on some kind of drugs because you gotta change this exhaust, boy, because this exhaust, well, not this one, but you need to change the stock exhaust, because let me tell you, stock, Z's sound like Nissan Leafs. Don't at me. I don't care how mad you get. If you don't have an exhaust, I feel for you, bro. I was there, but trust me. I don't know what Nissan was thinking. I've said this before in a video, but it's just like stock Z's don't have any sound to it. Maybe when you're wide open throttle, you'll get a little bit of a noise. But I mean, other than that, you don't hear shit. <laughs> so you gotta get an exhaust, man. Like. And I 100% recommend single exit. I know a lot, if you can afford a Tomei, get a Tomei. Uh, if you're gonna get a Tomei, I also recommend you get art pipes, not test pipes. Think about it, It'd rather sound nice and deep than raspy. That's what she said. Mine's a ISR single exit exhaust. Uh, if you guys wanna know, just check my channel. I, do, I did a review on it as well too. Very nice exhaust, I still like it. I still like it to this day. You have to get an exhaust, man, because these cars, bro, like stock, they just like, it's just like, I started my car, one time I got gas and I left the car on, I didn't even know it was still on. That's, uh, not, that doesn't sound like a sports car to me. That's honestly it. But before I end this video, I'm also gonna say, subscribe. I haven't given the boys a cold start in a little while, so let's hook it up a little bit. Plus, I'm not gonna lie, I just washed her, so I'm, I'm just trying to flex a little bit. Um, oh, and let me tell you guys, the silica sealant that this guy Badger 5.0 did, Roger, on my car, bruh, let me, dude, look at this. <laughs> Dude, she's bullying. Yo, look, she's shining like crazy, man. I haven't seen my car shine like this since I like first bought it, so I'm super hyped. Look at this, bro. Black is beautiful. Mm. Let's give the boys a cold start. Oh, you know I got my driving shoes on. my word for it get an exhaust if anything that might need to be your first your first mod just just make it your first mod don't like don't even bro before you even buy the car buy an exhaust like have it ready in the house like, mom look I got a car no you got an exhaust and you're gonna put it on immediately whoa whoa your boy is kind of dark here well whatever <laughs> it's come to that point of the video again where I'm just gonna have to say it's coming to an end but Nor Gang, if you guys like the video, make sure you do like and subscribe. Please share the video because we're almost at 500 subs. I know when some people are looking at this, like, I think right now we're at 360 something. They're like, whoa, 500. Believe me, we're growing super fast and it's really exciting. I appreciate it and love all of you guys. Nor Gang has been like awesome. Let's keep the movement going. We're almost at 500 subs. Just like and subscribe, share, tell your family, show your girlfriend or your boyfriend. I don't know. How many, I, mean, I don't even think I have that much of an audience that's women it's kind of a sausage fest out here whatever <laughs> if you guys like the video leave in the comments what you guys think are the top three mods that you would get for your z or i guess your car in general some of you guys have other random cars bro what are the first what was the first mod that you got just let me know all right thank you guys for watching i'll of course see you guys in the new one